Hi! Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, my name is Amaya. I just came back from Hobby Lobby and I figured I would do a little shop with me video for you all. I know it might seem a little bit early but last year I was super super late and like some of the stuff I wanted sold out so I learned my lesson and I went early this year and I wanted to share all the cute things that they have and some of the stuff that I picked up for myself. So first I'll show you what they have in the store and kind of walk you through some of the decor that I thought was really cute and then I'll show you what I picked up for myself. Hobby Lobby always has the best florals in my opinion. I love these and I actually bought them last year. I think they look so cute and they would be perfect for a little Halloween vibe as well. These are new this year and they're so stinking cute. They have them in the two colors and I think they would look really cute in a little vase. The pumpkin selection is huge. There are so many options. So I'll just share a couple of the ones that I like. I actually stopped by Joann's right after and they had a cheaper version over there. The only difference is the Hobby Lobby ones are plug-in and the Joann's one is battery powered. This pumpkin is new this year and it looks so cool like a concrete worn out look. And a lot of really soft pumpkins would be great for a bed or for a couch. And these wooden pumpkins are also new this year and they are so cute and really heavy. These I actually love and I used them last year to do a little fall DIY. I'll probably do it again this year because I love how they turned out. But I'll link the video above in case you're interested in some fall DIYs. I spotted this rug and I thought it was so cute and would actually look perfect for the fall or all year long. These little candles would be so cute for a little gift for any fall party. I also kind of love these faux brass turkeys and I actually might go back for this bigger one. And of course, all the kitchen stuff is always so cute. And I also love these kind of vintage style plates and I might go back for this one because I absolutely loved it. I am so excited for fall this year. Last year, like I said, I was a little bit late, so I feel like I didn't get to enjoy it that much. I think I started decorating like mid-September or even like early October, so I was extremely late and I feel like I missed like all the fun of the fall season. So this time around, I really wanted to be early so I can get the full enjoyment out of it. And there were so many cute pieces. So first and foremost, I want to show you what sold out last year that I really wanted and I wasn't able to get. So that hopefully if you were also looking for it, you will make that a priority for you to get this year and it's these beautiful magnolia stems i had seen a couple of people on instagram that had these from hobby lobby but again when i went they were already completely gone especially on camera i feel like they look very very realistic in person like clearly you can tell like they're kind of fake but i had seen some similar ones on etsy and they were so expensive so i feel like this is a really great dupe for those and they're much more affordable one interesting thing that i didn't notice because i feel like you can't really tell on the video is that they're kind of like fuzzy so it almost feels like a little velvety it's like fabric the leaves so i feel like that's what probably gets them to look so like soft and moldable and more realistic but i really like them they have some big pine cones here and here all the little leaves and these little like squiggly bits <laughs> but yeah they're so pretty i bought three of these they are each 18.99 but right now the false decor is already 40 percent off so i'm probably going to use these on my tv console table but i've seen people put them on their fireplace that would look super pretty as well or even like in a vase just like standing a bunch of them that would also look really pretty so we'll continue with the floral since i started with that already the next piece that i got that's technically part of the fall florals but i feel like you can use them anytime it's this stem here it's a really long stem and this one was 10.99 again with 40 percent off it would be less i'm planning to trim them especially these two big ones like this and maybe stick them in a longer vase i think that would look so cute and even though it is a fall floral i feel like it could look good all year long i think i might even have them right now for like the end of the summer until the fall starts it would be a really good like transitional piece and then i also got a couple of these so what i love about these is that they actually do sell them separately they sell this brown one and this cream colored one but i like that how they look combined together i think they look so cute and so good for the fall this set is 13.99 and i love that hobby lobby has a couple of stems that almost 
look like bouquets or like arrangements already i think that is so good so if you're a lazy decorator like i am you could just basically grab one or two of those and it's already basically set up for you like this looks so pretty as it is already i don't know 100 percent yet what i want to do with these i might just stick them in a vase because they're really cute but i did get two of these and then speaking of that like kind of bouquet style like already made for you i got this bunch here these are so big like this is my hand for reference but i think they look so freaking cute and again this is just one bunch it's 16.99 but it's so full like you can really see it's really really big i feel like normally you would have to buy several stems for it to get to look this full so i really like that you could just buy one and it's basically set so again i don't know what i want to do with these but i think probably just the vase would be pretty and this is one of those pieces that i feel like it's also versatile like you can get away with using it in the fall but also in the springtime i think this would look so pretty and even now in the summer i feel like you can get away with it but yeah the color is very like neutral so it can give fall but it can also give spring or summer then the last floral piece is actually a little tree but it's this beautiful maple tree in this kind of like faded brown color the tree is 49.99 again 40% off will be a lot cheaper and I really love it because the stem looks pretty realistic I thought it would be perfect for my little entryway area it comes in a regular black pot so I'm obviously going to put it in something else maybe a little basket or just in, like another cuter pot but I just thought it was so cute so I'm really excited to put that in my entryway so those are all the florals now on to all of the other goodies <laughs> there were so many cute things so I really had to control myself <laughs> I'm like I can't buy like that many things so i mostly try to get things that i didn't already have they did have a couple of new things this year and some of the other stuff that i showed in the video i already bought last year they did have quite a lot of new things this year i noticed so that was really exciting to see a couple of different things one of the new things that i saw are all these like little hay animals are super in style right now and i just had to get one and like normally i don't really go for them i did share when i decorated my shelf in the spring i did decorate with the little hay bunnies that i got from the target dollar spot and those were so cute and they're like really showing up in all the stores so i've been like resisting getting them i don't know why i guess it's because normally they have like really bright colors and i don't love to decorate with bright colors as you can probably see by my super neutral home <laughs> but i saw this one and i'm like i need to get him like he's so cute look at him he's a little raccoon and he's holding a pine cone so i saw this one and i was like i can't like i have to and they had a couple of other ones that were also really cute but like this one was my favorite and he was 10.99 and look at his little tail so cute so i don't know where i'm gonna put him yet probably like in a shelf or something but yeah and we should probably name him so i don't know what i'm gonna call him yet but <laughs> So I'll have to think of a little name for him and I will let you all know what I call him, but he's so cute. Another little decor piece I got is this really cute little painting on canvas. This is so cheap. It's $5.49 without the discount, which is absolutely crazy. And they do also have a pear one, which I also think is really cute. I might actually go back and get it since it's just a pear. You can get away with it like year round. Whereas the pumpkins, it's probably like just for the fall, it would look cute. But I think I'll swap out one of the paintings in the gallery wall for this one for the fall. I think that would look really cute i also got a couple of things maybe to diy with i don't know yet what i want to do with them but i got these little gourds y'all know i love garlands i think last year i made like two or three garlands so i might do the same thing this year because i am just obsessed with them and i really like that these gourds have different shapes i got the white one but they also have an orangey one if you like brighter colors and i don't know yet if i'll keep them white like this or if i'll paint them brown or like a different color but i thought that these would be really cute to do something something with and i also found these little mushrooms which i thought were so cute i might use them for a little diy i haven't decided yet if i should turn them into a garland also or if i want to use them for a couple of other diys i have planned so i just love doing little diys so i'll probably need more of these but yeah i thought that these were so cute and then i also saw these and i thought they were adorable so they're picks for floral arrangements but i feel like you could just pop them off of the stick and use them for something else again i was like a garland maybe 
but i do have a garland of like small little pumpkins already that i bought last year when everything went on sale so i probably don't need another pumpkin garland i don't know yet but <laughs> i just thought they were so cute so i just got a couple of those and again for a diy which i will share in the future i got some moss so i got this green one and then this that has a couple of different colors i think like by accident like not even like planned i am going for a bit of a foresty theme we have the little hay raccoon the moss the mushroom so i don't necessarily have like a theme in mind but i'm just like gravitating towards those things so i guess maybe we'll go along with it and make like a woodland themed fall decor situation we'll see and then the last thing i got is there's still spring decor left and everything i think is 66 percent off so definitely don't sleep on the summer spring collection at hobby lobby while it's on sale i got this little cheese knife set we actually have never had one and i told my husband i'm like maybe it's time <laughs> we get one you know i got this one that's a really pretty like gold color and the handles are a little bit like hammered i don't know if you can tell there but yeah they're originally 29.99 but they were 66 percent off so i think they came out to like 10 bucks which i thought was really good and i think this would be so cute if you do like a thanksgiving tablescape or something like that you could definitely use them for that even though it's part of the spring shop like they would still work for the fall or year round but that is everything that i got at hobby lobby i'm probably going to start decorating like the first week of august let me know in the comments below like when do you start decorating for fall is august too early because i don't really know i just know that last year i was extremely late so i'm trying to like beat myself from last year <laughs> but let me know in the comments when do you start decorating for fall i like to do things slowly so i'll probably start playing around with some of the stuff now and especially because i like to diy a lot of things it takes me a little bit longer to like actually get to the decorating part <laughs> so i figured i would start with hobby lobby where i usually get most of the supplies for all the diys i want to do and then probably next week or the week after that i'll share another fall shop with me where i'll hit up some more of my favorite stores like joann's and michael's probably target the target hearth and hand collection should be out by then which was so cute if you've missed that video definitely check it out i gave a little preview of what i would buy but look forward to another fall shop with me video in the future and a lot of decorating videos to come so make sure that you are subscribed and that you follow me on instagram so that you don't miss that but i will see you all very soon in another video bye